Hello and welcome to the Ritz 400 here at 8 Bowl Super Speedway. Joining me in the booth is Chris Louvier, Mr. Horny, and Stephen Paw the Third. Oh, well, I didn't get that title, thank God, but I'm here in the booth. <laughs> he is. He he is my wife, Mrs. Horny. What? No comment. Uh, moving on. On the pole today is Makoto Aguchi. Starting alongside is Nick Pericles. These two come in fourth and eighth in the points, respectfully. Row number two, Tristan Wilhoy and Alex May. Kyle Matthews and Vitaly Nikolaev make up row number three. Ali Nelson and Maxwell Chan, row four. And Brand Patterson and Amy Shelley, row number five. Here's the rest of the starting grid as I hand over to Steven to say what he expects to see today. Well, I have many of the last two nationwide truck races, you know, have been really busy. The co commenting life is getting busy, but, you know, uh, knowing this track and co commenting a Gen 6 race, um, I will expect the bumpers do not line up, I don't think, on these cars. So, um, it's going to be interesting. We'll see pit stops, and I, apparently, what I've been hearing from my, the officials in the booth that uh, somebody will blow up on pit road pulling out of the stall today. Well, that's, that was only in practice, but on the final row, we have Drew Austin and PJ Williams. And, Stephen, if you wouldn't mind, go ahead and make a prediction for us here today. Well, Please. I'm going to look at the 77, maybe to win, but an upset. Uh, I'm going to look at the Kyle Matthews 44. He's, almost, he's been try due for a breakthrough <coughs> in this series, and I think he can break through today if he does not blow his engine. Okay, Chris, That's you've been here all this week, so go ahead and give your prediction, and then maybe what you expect to see. Oh, man. Uh, let us see. Yep. Come on, come on! It's supposed to be way. There, there has to be some max involved, okay? <laughs> okay. Um. And a pick for today? I, I, I want to say Gabe was just a piss off, Steven. <laughs> but thirteen, uh, okay. Um, but uh, let's be realistic. Uh, realistic. Um, I'm gonna pick Amy Nelson just so you can actually bust that whole way through. <laughs> okay, so you pick car forty-one. Yes. Yeah. Kind of scrolling uh, through, I will go back up towards the front here. And I'll pick Vitaly Nikolaev to get his first cup win here today and win from the sixth starting spot. Well, you know, I was just in, in, in a, a Florida hospital, so let's get this race going on. Well, pace car pulls off in a dangerous spot there for this track, but the green flag is out. We're underway for the Ritz 400. Don't ask me how I ended up in that hospital, but here we go. Three wide no, in the back. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that didn't take long. Up, oh, uh, well, uh, there goes my pick. <laughs> well, well it's early. Guys. There's 30 laps here to go, or 30 laps in this one. Longest race of the weekend. We, we have um, the Emmon. We have the we have some Halloween schemes, the camel scheme, and a 1990 Dodge Emmy. And wow, way to the race to actually probably get to a little bit of the lag there. As Maxwell Chan, Amy Shelley making a little oh, bit of contact. Oh my god. That, that's what you call Boy, wheeling that got and close already. That's what you call wheeling and dealing right there. Make a bet. It is. No caution as they come out oh, turn number four. Oh, 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 man. And it'll be Makoto Aguchi for Penske Racing leading lap one. We should start making bets with the drivers we pick gets the highest and the winner gets, I don't know, like five bucks or something. <laughs> <laughs> Here comes Nick Pedicles and looks like Mr. Wilhoit. Yep, Tristan Wilhoit for Ganassi. Um, Valvoline refused to sponsor this weekend, so they went with homes123.com. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's going to go with Nick Pericles here to the inside of Makoto. And the Dodge 123 is going to become a Dodge 12 as Maxwell Chan's going to move into third. I didn't know yep. Budweiser sponsored the nine car in 2005. It's a fictional. Oh, okay. Okay. It looks like I found someone that painted a Casey Kane fictional on the nine, so I was like, okay. And uh, who oh, is yeah. it? Oh. As I saw someone spun, the caution and flag is out, and our points. Oh. two of our top three in points. Our top three in points. Are you no, I <laughs> Our top three in points are all involved: Eric and Rage, <laughs> Mary Shelley, and Charles Jackson. <laughs> Alex Perkle's involved as well. How many you get involved? <laughs> Dual. The top three in points are involved in the same incident. Let me just say for the, let me just say for the record, this is going into the 100th anniversary or 100th video, whatever it's called in Charles's thing. Wow. Well, actually, what I've decided to do for that is probably just gather my top ten favorite moments and put them all in their own separate video. This will go into. But today. Jackson's this, day this, is already done. This is literally the top three in points. 
Tony just Allen damn. He's literally the and top the three points. And the Gucci's a seventh. <laughs> the only person in order is Eric and Reid. Makoto Gucci, fourth in points, has survived. <laughs> wow. I think Seth is. I don't see anyone else with damage. Mary Cole and Seth Cole having to uh, set out who was actually in front of who at the time of the question. Jeff James and Dylan Young are on pit road. Uh, and they've I all guess. retired. The top three points just retired from this race. Like, oh my god. So, are you serious? I used to, Charles, they just did, they literally are the top three just right. I've never. Okay, played. so what we're gonna do is he's right. All three of them have retired. Let's go back and see what happened. And we are back, and the points leader is gonna get into second in the points, Charles Jackson. And collect oh. the and third then, yeah, place. And collect Eric and Rage. You know how this went? I'm gonna turn him. Oh wait, I'm gonna hit the wall. Let's get third place real quick. <laughs> oh my god. Well, it's Mary well, Shelley actually that's gonna come back up the track. And collect it. There's Eric and Rage and Alex Perkle and PJ Williams all getting a piece of this as well. Let's say, wow, and that's Drew really Austin. Bad. Drew Austin that's, involved as well. Yes. Absolutely. I, I, I cannot believe the top three points just all put each other out on lap two of 30. I mean, I've seen a lot of dumb things in our side of three before. Now, that said, there's more dumb stuff to happen as coming Jeff. back to a caution, Jeff James, Dylan Young, we saw them on pit road, and this is the reason why for that. Uh, I, I think this is the perfect title when we get to it. I'll, I'll say in a second. You see them come across the line. No harm, no foul yet. Five wide. So, so Five you know, wide. And you know, apparently something happened that some uh, previous race that we didn't know about. Dil and Jeff James not too happy with Dylan Young. He's going to come down like, the track a little bit here. I don't like how you race me anymore. And he, just, and he just decides to be... And Dylan Young doesn't have anywhere to go, pretty much. And just... There they go. What yep. is it? Kyle Thomas going to get involved. And Mary Cole as well. What is it? Wow. 2012 Phoenix? Who knows? Wow, this is what Jeff James did. So, unfortunate for Jeff there. And no... Uh, and really, actually, more Dylan Young. No fault of his own getting wrecked there. But oh, with that, let's go back to Green Flag. And we are back. No other retirements other than the top three in points. Jeff James, Dylan Young, two laps down. And your top ten, Nick Pericles, Tristan Wilhoyt, Maxwell Chan, Zachary Fitzwater, Alex May, Henry Sanford, Makoto Gucci, Tom Shelley, Kyle Matthews, and Amy Shelley. And I got to ask, what do you think is the strategy now for Makoto Gucci? She came into this race 106 points back, and now not we know she's going to pass Eric and Rage in the points. But what do you think is her strategy to maybe try and pass Charles Jackson and Mary Shelley here? Two words, don't wreck. <laughs> and win. Oh my god, what are they doing? Oh, lapped goodness. Cars, lapped cars. They're lapped oh. cars. Oh my gosh, that's going to be so, you great. Know, all that Cole wants to do is come up here and win the race. He has a shot to take the point, please. Oh my gosh, did that 15 just jump for me? I don't even know. No. Let's well, it might jump for you, but it didn't jump actually. Dylan Young, Jeff James off the pace a little bit, holding up Maxwell Chan there. Are you ready for another wreck? Let's see if it involves oh, oh boy, here we go. Oh boy. Let's see if it involves third, fourth, and sixth in the points this time. That would be, uh, you know, how the race goes. Fourth, Amelia. Oh yeah, that's two. The fourth, fourth is actually in this pack. Oh my gosh. It's... Well, we'll see. I mean, this could be a very interesting points day if that does happen. Uh, seventh in the Oh, the 44, the 44. One. I saw a 44 again, getting a bit too close. Uh, okay, yes, I saw 44 by the... Tom it. Shelley and Jeff James, I'm getting a little nervous of that. Yeah, they're about to they, turn each... Oh, there goes the 44 again. Dylan Young cannot be making too many friends, especially not with Maxwell Chan back there. Uh, Ma no, Ma my... Max about to turn that Dylan Young. <laughs> well, my pick's still up there, guys, so, you know, I'm getting that uh, hotel suite first tonight. <laughs> and my pick is somewhere. It's probably in this damn pack. Somewhere in the back. No, I'm kidding. Boy, Dylan Young's got to get out of the way. He is definitely off the pace compared to the rest of the field. Someone's going to turn Dylan Young, trust me. Hey, there's Louvier, yeah. He's probably going to cause a big one. But. Oh, yep. Especially if, if he's... Oh, boy. Here we go. Here's here's Makoto getting to the inside of Dylan Young now. You know my advice? Don't wreck. I don't think... Oh, it's... four wide! Four wide! Oh, crap, 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 crap. Oh, crap. I don't think he's taking my advice. I don't think they're going to be listening. 
Here we go. Here's... I think they settled it to three wide back and here's there, Gabe nice and smooth. And now the pack starting to form back up. And how about my pick, Vitaly Nikolaev, running second right now. I uh. might not get that hotel suite now. Oh, wow. His... Kyle Matthews, Luvier's pick is up here in third. Man, what is the pick of the night? I guess so. Where the hell is Ami Nelson? She's my pick. Oh, wait. Who picked Matthews in? Someone picked Matthews. No one picked Matthews. I don't even know who Matthews did. Oh. Okay, Ali Nelson. God, no, you picked Matthews. It. Okay. I love Nelson's that. Nelson's 29. I love that Coca Cola on the quarter panel, though. Very fitting. It's right? game. I saw game. So how about? Okay, so now Vitali got thrown back a little bit. Matthews coming up to the They're lead. Go three, and Henry Sanford goes inside even farther. After good. Trying to get PPI Motorsports there. Fourth win as a team is well, Jeff James. They won back in season one with Gene Sanford behind the wheel, and then won twice with Matt Dixon behind the wheel last season. Well, I Jeff think Henry, Henry, just, Henry just came off a win at Daytona in uh, Chris Walsh's league, so he has to match that experience. Well, thanks for I didn't know that. <laughs> oh, well, sorry. Oh, wait, it's 4 uh, I. I thought so, 4 I. Uh, you probably did. Right back here is a, it's a staggered four wide now. Gabe Williams back here. Gabe Williams is gonna turn the 18 at call. No, <laughs> oh no. my, this is gonna be close. Oh <laughs> my gosh. You almost called it. I almost did. <laughs> my prediction. But, never but yeah, you're right, uh, Chris. Jeff James definitely up to speed in the 15 there. Where the heck is Despite Jeff? being two laps down. Where the heck is Jeff Cole? Let's take a look. Let's find that number 25. That's the GMAC Ditech.com Chevrolet back in 26th right now. Yeah, that's, Patterson. Not, that's not where he wants to be. Patterson, 17, up in 9th right now, but actually in, he's actually about 5th right now as they run. He can take the points Just lead. Just looking at where they are. He can still take the points lead. Oh, if he doesn't uh, get oh Tom Shelley <laughs> got into him and oh, we go What this just right now? I literally cannot believe it. This may That's fourth and sixth. What about fifth at point? Mary Cole's in it. What about fifth at point? Steph, Steph get involved in this, I swear to God, if Steph got involved, I'm done. Matthews leads back to the caution. Let's find this, the 25. Seth. Okay. Seth is all right in 26. Seth is going to take the points lead if he wins. Guaranteed. <laughs> oh, Gucci, though. You got to feel... Oh, Pericles, seventh in points. Everyone in the points besides Seth has wrecked. This is hilarious. What about Patterson? He got involved, too? This is hilarious. Patterson was the like guy who originally turned. Him. Gabe Williams ninth in points is in seventh. Oh, oh my. God! I was about to say for F sake, Gabe Williams is going to take the points lead. Mary Cole, <laughs> Jeff James, Pericles. I swear to God, Koto if, Gucci's car is just absolutely destroyed. I swear to God, if Gabe Williams takes the points lead, I will literally maybe cry or shed a tear during the broadcast. Is that actually possible in this race? Yes, it actually is. Uh, it's, it would be actually. Yeah, um, because Mary's Mary's in at like 40 points. I'm about to get a deer. Oh my gosh, this is going to be amazing. Well, you still have to win the race, though. I'm going to yes. sure. But let's go ahead and take a look back at what happened to bring out the caution. Well, we saw the reason, but let's try and take a look at who all's involved. And we are back, and unfortunately, you got a feel for Makoto Gucci. Nothing she could have done here at all. Tom Shelley's going to get into the 17 back there. He's going to come down the track into Amy Shelley and Jeff James and just gets clipped. That quarter panel, and that's not, he didn't get that much damage, and someone just came with the full out archer break. Well, that, um, Jeff James. Now remember, they're still racing back. That's why. Mary Cole. Oh, oh that's head on. Remember, reminds me of Daytona when she did that. So she's not really the SS breaker. Well, remember, they're still racing back to the caution at this Where point. Where did Dylan Young get involved the... in this? Well, remember, he was just off the pace, I think. He was behind it. He didn't get into it at all. I love the 21. I mean, she, she thought she was in the Air Force and she wanted to fly, but she can't fly with a car. <laughs> <laughs> See, Dylan gets by it. Yeah. Easily. How did Patrick but what we need to take a look at is why is Pericles' car smoking? He must have clipped it, that's why. Oh no, he just blew up. Oh no, there was some more contact. There was actually uh, more contact, we didn't see. Well, I saw that, and that's why I was coming back here. Oh, oh wow. Clip, well, clip Amy it. Shelley, Tom Shelley, and Pericles, and he almost has it saved, but then Daniel Day. Daniel, uh, Day. Daniel Day with his fifth wreck of the week. Daniel Day. Huh. No, actually, he did not wreck it all yesterday. Well... 
That's amazing. That's his first wreck of the week. That's amazing. And they go with Pokey's day. How much? How damaged? The so yeah, six of the top seven in points have encountered issues here today and are actually probably done. Uh, Burn Patterson might be able to still run, but he is not going to be at all competitive. For God's sake, Gabe Williams Shh. is going to take the points lead today. Gabe Williams and Seth Cole, we now look at, are the top guys to maybe take over the points lead, if anyone does. Or it might be Mary Shelley hanging on to it despite a bad day. What is he doing? But oh. we've reco- we've covered everything that happened underneath the caution, other than the fact that Pericles acting really weird right now. <laughs> He's just smoothing. Um, he had some blood in the car. And so with that, we'll go back to the green flag here from 8 Bolt. And well, we, we are have, back. We just well, ran we through the scenarios morning. with the co-commentaries here. But out of the race are as follows. Nick Pericles, Mary Cole, Makoto Gucci, and Jeff James. Dylan Young is still out there two laps down. The top ten is Kyle Matthews, Vitaly Nikolaev, Henry Sanford, Troy King, Will Lewis, Zachary Fitzwater, Gabe Williams, Maxwell Chan, Tristan Wilhoyt, and Alex May. And what we're just going through is what would have to happen for Seth Cole or Gabe Williams to leave here as the points leader. Gabe Williams, if he leads the lap, or if he wins the race, but does not lead the most laps, he'll leave here tied with Mary Shelley. If he wins the race and leads the most laps, he'll leave here ahead and in the points lead. Seth Cole just has to finish third or better without leading a lap. And he will, or he doesn't have to lead a lap, he just has to finish third or better and he'll leave here as the points leader. As so, as high, they still have to do a lot to actually leave here as the points leader, but it's possible. As we come down to the green flag, halfway home here in the Ritz 400. Here we go in Demi Young. Oh my, why are they taking the damn Ensai? Just following the damn pack. Just well, follow. they want, they felt like they could probably get there a little bit better. Maybe Dylan Young's not as off the pace as we thought. Uh, maybe just, well, maybe some Timor and some Hendrick, maybe. Mm-hmm. Yes. Well, I don't think there's any affiliation necessarily with PPI Motorsports and Hendrick Motorsports. I was talking about the 24 and the 44, but... Oh my gosh, then go through... Uh, Gabe is climbing up. Well, here we go, Gabe Williams. The 19! Oh, Fitzwater, oh, come on! So oh, you're serious! So close. I the 19 not. just pretty much... <laughs> give him a Fitzwater pump down. Fitzwater just tried to take a shot at the 32. Gabe Williams has got, got to go up there and lead every single lap, yo. And his sheet, and I... Well, here we go. Three wide for the lead. Troy King with help from Gabe Williams. Oh, oh my god. If Gabe beats Gabe with the points lead, I might shed a tear. <laughs> oh, my god. He's on the bottom. Oh, man. He's on that bumper. Here we go. He there's better the hope there's a caution here. Maxwell when he Chan into Gabe. third. That's what he has to hope for. Can Gabe Williams go for the race lead here into turn number four? He, or and turn number three, at least. That old dog he, engine is getting sent to the pit. If he blows up, oh my gosh. NASCAR, I have told NASCAR to show the black flag because they've been told to start and park. Fitz, oh boy, I was going to say Fitzwater to the right rear there of Sanford almost. They're about to go three, uh, but four wide, but no. Oh, here comes Maxwell Chan like, oh. going for, I believe, for... Oh um, no, Will Lewis is not going for for second. Will Lewis three wide for second. Well, there goes Gabe Williams' chance of taking the points lead. <laughs> well, it's still there. He's in the draft. He's got a shot. Yeah, and and I it's, I have a shot too, and I'm not even racing. And he's, and Gabe has the further line. He does. And now he does. You no, know, I when I was in the Florida hospital bed, I was wondering when I came to Massachusetts to see if Gabe Williams was going to win or not. And I'm seeing he could win, and I'm going to shed a tear now. <laughs> so, oh, and Seth Cole now to the back bumper of Fitzwater. It's going to find the inside line there. And Alex hooked. Hawkins goes even lower, though. My, my I guess Seth's going to get hooked for trying too hard. And his Gabe, he's now, now he's back in line. Will Lewis inside of Troy King. All right, for the no, no, I mean my guess is Seth is going to turn Gabe. Oh yeah, that's true. And that didn't. Oh my God, Seth, don't be a dick. <laughs> well, we got that on the. Well, we got that in the bloopers. <laughs> Please don't be a dick, Seth. We got that twice. In my, oh my God! Oh my God! Here we go. <laughs> Gabe Williams to the inside of Will Lewis for the race you know, lead. The, you know the game. A is very important to lap to be led. The, the game is starting to lag because this is unfreaking believable. <laughs> Troy King, Zachary Fitzwater, 
second and third. Maxwell Chan up to fourth. Oh, for fuck. Oh, my God. Oh, my oh, God. My. Here we go. It's going to be Gate Williams leading the lap, but they're going to be three wide for the race lead as they enter turn number one with 11 laps to go. Thank you, 19, for saving my sanity. <laughs> Your sanity has not yet been saved. No, it has. Seth Cole up here in the top 10. Louvier's up uh, here. He came. <laughs> Especially when I went flying through the air in an IndyCar over Seth Cole. Oh, here we go. Oh, boy. Here we go. Henry Sanford up here trying to break a long winless streak. I'm going to use the famous words of ESPN. Do they all make it back? I don't know. I'm trying to find, I'm trying to find who the hell is the damn 19. Fitzwater. Zachary Fitzwater. Oh, what? Oh, I... No. <laughs> As here they come. Troy King inside of Henry Sanford for second 10 to go oh. from a ball. Oh, come on. I just... Just shut Gabe Williams, Seth Cole, right up here on the outside line together. I oh bet it's Seth, Gabe's going to turn him. Just watch. Oh, no. oh Hawkins! <laughs> I might not like the car, but that was one hell of a save. I'm going to give him that. <laughs> All right, in the middle of the pack. Saved it. I'm going to give credit. I might not like the car, but I'm going to give credit. That was one hell of a save. But when you're running old Taking the lead. Run Troy King to the lead. Kyle... I swear, someone picked Kyle Matthews to win this race. That was race. me. Okay, Kyle Matthews to second. Henry Sanford to third. I'm going to win bragging rights this There's Allie Nelson. Wait, is that Nelson? Allie Nelson's up here, yeah. Well, you know, what? it's not... The 41 car. You no, know, it's not really hard to save a car. Oh, there's a latch car. <laughs> there's a latch car. It's PJ Williams. Oh, crap. Oh, my God. He's going 170 to their 190. Oh, oh God. my That's God. I check That's... myself. What is the 44 doing? <laughs> I don't even know anymore. I, oh, here we go. This is not going to be good. He's on, think, a, he's on the bloody end sign line. There's a huge break think, in the pack. I think the 18 is took it. The, the caution's out. The caution is out. Alex Hawkins has gone around. Oh, right. It's not. Henrietta Fitzwater's involved. Oh, green, white, checkered, folks. Not yet. Way too early to say that. Oh, uh, Tristan Wilhoit's here. Uh, just that sums it up. That's pretty it's much dog. Just like, just like my wreck in IndyCar. Coming back to the line, Seth Cole and Gabe Williams both survive yet again. Seth is in third. Oh, he would be a points As leader. As they run, Seth Cole would be the points leader. Seth Cole is really happy he's going to get some Snickers now. But this race will get back to green. Thank God. Oh my, fortunately. Now... We need to go ahead and take a look at what happened between the 22 and the 20 here in turn number one. And we're back. Here's what happened down in turn number one. Looks Wait, like maybe five. Meacham's going to get into Tristan Wilhoy here. Yes, he does. Comes down oh, wow. into Henrietta Fitzwater, Alex Hawkins, and Vitaly Nikolaev. Momo Kari gets turned as well. I'm going to do my best Jim Roth impression. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my God. Oh, and Gene God. Sanford gets by this. A little bit of damage to 43. Oh my god. Oh good god, that killed him. Oh. That bit dead. A little bit, yeah. Ah, oh, darn. That, well, that's going to kill any shot Gene had of ending that 59 race winless streak. In that, in that Actually, I, think it's almost, I think it's 60 now. It's going to be like... Well, it will be 60 no matter what, but I think it's 60 coming in. When you have the nose bent in, I don't think you're going to be winning. Yeah, yeah. That's, what, that's what I was saying. I think that will put an end to any shot she had of ending the winless streak. But when Gabe she has Williams the longest got... winless streak of anyone right now in Coke Vanilla Cup Series. Other than Tom Gerard, who's actually really gone 79 races uh, without winning. He did miss one race back in Season 1, so i kind of been lying when I said he, was, he started every race. Oh, wow. <laughs> well, you know, it's, it's not really hard to get up to the field. Uh, the Rusty Wall 2002 car is run by Gabe Williams. Well... With that, let's go back to the green flag. Shipping up to be a great finish here from 8 Bowl. And we are back. Gene Sanford and Tristan Wilhoit, the only casualties of that caution. As I went to fast slap now. Shoot. Okay. Uh, PJ Williams, one lap down. Dylan Young is two laps down. Hawkins, two laps down on pit row. Oh, well, nope, never mind. He's back out there. Your top ten, though, is Troy King, Will Lewis, Seth Cole, Roman Rahal, Kyle Matthews. Katie Elizabeth runs six. Allie Nelson, Henry Sanford, Chris Louvier, and Alex May. 
William Duncan still has a shot in 11th. Fitzwater, I'd say, is probably a long shot with 12th. Sosnowski, Chan, Gabe Williams there, Daniel Day, Elijah Workman, Tom Gerard. I love you. And those are the only guys without damage. Now, I say it's probably a long shot for the guys from like Fitzwater on back because they'd have to get around the lap car of Williams first and then be in contention. Meacham on back, probably not going to be in contention because of damage. You have Momokari, 20th, Vitaly Nikolaev, Ish Taylor, Drew Austin, Tom Shelley, Chris Washer, Amy Shelley, Henrietta Fitzwater, Kyle Thomas with no hood, Brennan Patterson, and Alex Perkle. In the hood. <coughs> and with no hood. Yeah. In the hood. I'm in the hood with no hood. Oh, my God. Well, here we go. Pace car will pull off, leaving us with four laps to go when we hit the stripe. Troy King leads. Seth Cole would be the points leader as they run. In that game. And how will these final four laps shape out? I'm just going to say this. For, I'm, I'm saying this for Seth. Anybody who passed him is banned from the RCA. I got a feeling that we have. Well, he's got a good friend there behind him, doesn't he? Kyle Matthews, his teammate, is running in third now. Well, he's my pick, so I got to get these bragging rights, so I better go up there and take the lead. <clears throat> let's, let's see if May can help Cole. Win or try and help your teammate get the points lead. Uh, I think how, difficult situation there. How about just wreck your teammate? That would be even smarter. <laughs> that, that's <laughs> just... <laughs> <laughs> well, Seth Cole to the lead. Kyle Matthews into second. Will Lewis and Henry Sand for third and fourth. Let's and I think that is, it's Chris Louvier that's going to be going into fifth. That's if Louvier wins the race when he's co-commentating it. <laughs> oh, look. <laughs> oh, boy, here we go. go crazy. Kyle Matthews, Will Lewis inside of <laughs> set. No, don't go full my day. Oh, I right. put a bed. Come on, and don't wreck. That is bad teammating, isn't it? Seth Cole now falls out of the top three. Oh, I think wow. Some, I think someone just got banned. And another one of his teammates passed him, Sosnowski. <laughs> well, Sonoski can't go four lanes with cars right next to him. That is the smartest thing ever. It's going to go three one for second. And how about oh. Gabe Williams is right back up in this pack. How about that number one car, though, of Chris Louvier? <laughs> if, if... Well, Louvier's on the top line. If... 20 years of trying. Coming down, they'll see two laps to go at the stripe. Will Lewis leads. Kyle Matthews. Henry Sanford, Allie Nelson, and Seth Cole, the top five. Right. Here, here five. comes Matthews. 20 years of frustration. Chris Lillier is finally in the lead pack. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> here comes Seth. Wow, Seth. So Matthews now to the lead. Seth back up into the top three. Man, I think we might have a Fitzwater on the left rear quarter panel of Nelson's car. Might have, we might have a little retaliation shot, I'm feeling, on the number 25. That's true. Oh. Here we go, set to the lead. Seth, yep, here we go. Might be making the move a little too early, that though. Is a, that is, that is way too, nope. I, no, I think Seth, no, that's, Seth is not going to hey, win hey, this. Hey, Charles, what about that long shot in third place? That's, Zachary that's Fitzwater. Fitzwater. How about William Duncan up here in fourth? What about Gabe Williams, though? Way back there, he's not got a shot at this one, though. Why you flag the air? I think he's way too far back, coming to the white flag and in the wrong lane too. Okay, Seth Cole, Will uh, Lewis to the lead. Oh Seth my gosh! For his life. Imagine Duncan in this. The only Ganassi car that's done any good all season is running in the lead right now. He got, Duncan into second. I looking for his first win of the season. He's won one at least in every season so far. I think Duncan. I think it's gonna be Will Lewis. Will though. Lewis. No one's been able to make Bobby a shit. coming off this corner. Here comes, here comes. Seth Cole's into third. Oh, don't. He's gonna wreck. He's oh. gonna wreck. He's gonna wreck him. He's gonna wreck him. Oh, my God. Oh, Seth boy. Seth like Duncan. I got that team. It's gonna be oh, Lewis oh, coming oh, to the oh, win. Oh, 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 Duncan, what a save. Oh, my God. It's gonna be Will Lewis leading. Duncan second, Fitzwater third, and Seth Cole cost himself the points lead right there. Oh, God. Oh, leaving this Oh, race. my God. And wow. Years of frustration, 20 years of trying. Chris Louvier got seventh place. <laughs> At least I got. What a save by Duncan! What a oh. save by Duncan! Yeah. And the San Francisco Giants have won the World Series. No. Motherfucker. <laughs> that one just went final. I just. Wait, <laughs> I'm so just you know, this, we're gonna try to get this commentary team for the rest of the season because a lot of people tune in if we have this team. Here. Will Lewis for T 
Team Ganassi wins the race. Duncan comes from second, only like two hundredths ahead of Zachary Fitzwater. I just love how the race. Seth Cole in fourth. Henry Sanford will come on fifth. Ali Nelson, how about two Ganassi cars in the top ten? That's probably the first time that's happened a lot. <laughs> Chris Livier seventh. Kyle Matthews eighth. Kyle Sosnowski ninth. And Katie Elizabeth tenth. And so I think by s mere luck, somehow, Mary Shelley's still going to lead this race the points lead. You're going to be tied. No. Seth, no. Seth would have had to have like, Seth, I don't think, led a lot. Yeah, he did. He, he won first. He took the lead, and then the 44 dumped him. But did he lead the lap? Yeah, he led the lap. You like <gasps> seeing those well, then girls. Seth, then Seth would leave here as the points leader. Yes. So points leader from fifth to first. He, he wouldn't have a tie or anything. It'd be he'd lead it solely. Yeah, so, so two points leader is Death Cole, folks. Um, other notables: Gabe Williams, eighth in points coming in, finishes twelfth. Daniel Day, fourteenth. Alex May comes home 15th. He had Maxwell down there in 16th. Mr. Unlucky finishes on the lead lap in 17th. Elijah Workman, 9th in points in 19th. My pick to win today, Vitaly Nikolaev, 21st. Um, and looking at the picks, Nelson was the top one. Oh, man. Yeah. I ain't gonna, oh, my I'm not, picks is looking at the top 10. <laughs> oh, <laughs> man. I'm, I'm not getting that luxury sweet tonight. Ah. Uh. Um, looking at the bottom of the result, uh, we had the defending champion Trevor Meacham, 26 today. And of course, we got the top three in points. Let's see. Well, I love the race pace of 132, but you know, who, who, beggars can't be choosers. Oh my. That, so wow, what a day here. I'll hand it over to Louvier and Pollard for their final thoughts. Luvier, oh my, first. oh my gosh, that was amazing. I just got my I I just got my Sloan the entire time. <laughs> okay, uh, my thoughts. Good luck following that up. <laughs> I know. Oh, uh, it was, was a great fun. race, Lincoln Lewis. I don't think I've ever seen the top three wreck in one race. But no. Well, top three in points. Three. Point. We, we, you've probably seen top three not, wreck I, at one in a race. I, but. I don't have bragging rights. But good job, Lewis. And I'll try to be making a trucker nationwide race sometime soon. Cause, you know, I passed that system. Oh yeah, but remember, Lewis, do not do horrible, please. <laughs> okay, so, congrats to Will Lewis on winning the Ritz 400 here today. For Chris Livier and Stephen Paul III, I'm Gorn Fan 291, and this has been a production of the Iron Roll Racing and Contained. We'll see you next time. All three vin all three series going to different tracks. Should be interesting. Oh my, that's, that's sexy. <laughs>